You had my hopes up for a second there. Right? Baby! Yeah, so one more episode of this. Number of holes. Um. In or out? In. Pick one. Let's just do this to finish off the series. Oh man, how Let's make this far quick. we come. Yeah, because this takes so long. How I do. I'm just gonna, I'm actually not gonna go into the things. I'm just gonna do it. I'm going big. I'm going for real. What's that marking? Just hit it. Oh, that's what it is. Okay. <laughs> I hit myself! Where'd I go? Awesome. And the course makes him look so tiny. Right? Just make the same shot as me and you'll make it. I'm using Mario Golf controls, but it's not working. So awkward. <laughs> Putt. What? Please don't putt. Here we go. I have a better drive distance than you. How? You're a baby. Maybe I just didn't use the right club. That could be it. Well, actually, no, the wind is, um... Advantageous? Well, our wind is the same, but it made me fall shorter, and it's going to make you fall way short. Ha! Why? Because <laughs> you, you didn't get full power. Full power? Not full power shouldn't have affected it that much. There's wind as well. There's 10 miles an hour of wind. So try again. Nice. Nice. <laughs> Awkward replays. You're going to go over the other side. Ah. You are. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, I feel so bad for you. Can we not do this mode? No, we're doing this mode. Look, they've seen it. They're, they're content. No, we're doing this mode. We're at least doing some of the holes Oops. of it. <laughs> oh my goodness, no. <laughs> You're good at golf games. I am. But wow. This stinks. Wow. Wow. I could start again because I'm behind. Yeah. You're not even looking where you're going. You're going to go f too far now. No, I guess you're good. No, you fell. <laughs> Why? I guess not. Did you do it? You better have done it. Okay. Man. First of all, the golf mode is bad. Like, it's really bad. But also, you're up to shot nine. And... You know what? Let's just do two holes, I think. Nine holes is insane. We're doing, we're doing two holes. Because... <laughs> Wow. I did that on purpose. What? What? Oh, because he did 10 shots. To my one. Oh. Is there a mercy mode? I guess. Man, that's a shot. How do I do backspin? Probably D. No. Just a guess. Uh, let's just see. Backspin. Back camera hit the ball. There is none. Okay, then. That's another point against this mode. Yeah, so we're just doing two holes on this, I think. If we survive this one. I'm not sure what that did. That made your shot higher, I believe. What, curved it? Oh, there's wind. Okay, well, I'm fine. I'm content with that shot. And you gave up, so... No, I didn't. It gave up. Um... Kay. Ooh, if I make this perfect... If I putt it, it'll actually go further. But I'm thinking this. You can't putt over air. It, it says it'll la launch because there it'd go off a ramp. Okay, this, that. I think that'll do it. Good, good, nice. Nah. Nah. It's a perfect shot, actually, almost. Okay, and the wind no longer matters, so I just have to. Make the shot. Please putt. How do I... 
Okay, that's how I do it. Um, 90 feet. Full power. 90 feet and half power, I think. There. Ish. Yeah. Right. Nope. Okay. There's a hill. Is there? Yeah. You can't tell in this game. Okay, that's fine. Just like here. That's 30 feet. I did. I, I did par. So we're going to show one more hole and then we're going to cut it there because golf is time extensive and it's also it's bad. Up. Like the first, what is it, two, four, six? For six modes are good. Uh, like all the all the ones that we did in the competition. Yeah, are good. The other ones, like, well, billiards is also good. But besides that, none of the other ones are really good. Um, and yet we spent so much time trying to figure out how to earn them. Yep. Just so we could say we did. And boosh. And I think I did it. Maybe L and R buttons do spin. Ooh, nice bounce. Thank you. I'm. <laughs> I'm. What's his name? The Tiger Woods. Tiger Woods. <laughs> I was thinking Elijah. Different Woods. I guess Elijah Woods is Elijah Wood. Yeah. Put a slight curve on it. No, I didn't. And you die. I think it's Baby that is the problem. I think Baby's just super awkward. Nice. I had actually wanted to do this game for an Alpha Beta Omega for a while now. Really? Baby? That's not even Nova. Nova's good at tennis games. Tennis. Or, sorry, not tennis games. <laughs> golf games. She's really good at golf games, but... They're not gonna believe you. Baby's just trash. Are you sure the monkeys are different in this one? Probably. Or maybe, it, maybe it's just that Nova's used to a good <laughs> golf game? Okay, I thought you were gonna fall off the edge. It's your turn again. You're gonna get a double bogey off of this, I think? If you make it on this shot? Good. So far. <laughs> but how will fate turn this horribly awry? There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Well, there's wind, Nova. There's really strong wind oh, right I now. I keep forgetting to look at the wind. Yeah, do do full full charge, and you'll get it in. Actually, you might just get it straight up in. Why is the wind always against us right now? Um. In Mario Golf, it's a random direction. Because it's bad. It's bad wind. Ah, <laughs> uh, this game. You gave up. <laughs> okay. That was fun. My turn. How about you give up too? <laughs> nah, I'm gonna do this. Do do it a little bit to the left there because of the wind, and do a full charge. Full charge, perfect. And then I think that'll oh. get in. Might even get like actually legitimately in the hole. No. Don't get your hopes so high. Um, you why would I hop this yet. in? Was that is that putt? No. What, what is putt? There's putt. You're still on the fairway. You can't putt. Yeah, I can. I'm putting right now. Why can't I putt? I'm saying it's a bad idea to putt. I'm gonna putt. Um, do that. Go for 45, 50% power. Probably 45. And call that good. Like that. Like that. Yeah! I did it. You're gonna give up too? No, no, no. I have six shots to do this. Go down. Go down. Go down. There we go. Okay. Let's give it a little bit more. <laughs> uh, the physics of this game. Five shots remaining. Full power, baby. <laughs> uh. Why does this game exist? Like I said, this is giving the the game kind of a a bad look, but there we go. But like the game's good. It's just soccer 
Um, golf. What are the other ones? And baseball. And baseball just aren't that good. They stink. They're just pretty. They're pretty bad. Okay. This amount of power should be good. Like right there. <laughs> Idiot <laughs> of a of a monkey. Right there. Thank you. Cup in nine! Yeah! And I still won! And we're gonna quit this because this is ridiculous. So, I ended up winning this. But, I don't think anyone really won this game. And with that, the series is now over on that very climactic note. You're, you're speechless. I had an idea. What? The race tracks from Monkey Ball 1. We will do Monkey Ball 1 at some point. Okay. Yeah, we will. Don't worry. I mean, it it doesn't have dogfight, but it's still pretty good. Have you already mentioned how you can earn all of the party games without beating story mode? No. You didn't mention that? No, I don't I don't know what you're talking about. It's very important. Okay. So there are you start out with what three party games? Yeah, something and then like you that. have to earn the rest. Can't you just play them over and over? The way you do that is you go into practice story mode you uh -huh. play through it as far as you can get and then start over from the beginning so mm. you erase your story mode data or whatever why did you do that yeah so you erase your log and then you start over and keep doing that and keep doing that and you'll earn enough points to earn all of the party games okay so tips in case you want to get the game and you don't want to play through story mode. I, I know someone in the comments had mentioned how they got it uh, the re-release for the 3DS hmm. um, and it was really hard so I mean if you want to earn everything, do that. Um, because we've had this game for years. For years and look none of us have gotten past World 3. Yeah. I mean I have once. I think I got to World 4 but that was on another card but, um, but yeah this game is pretty good and I'm not sure if I'll ever be covering story because it's literally insane. It's basically a platformer, but in the monkey balls, and it's really hard. Um, but I will probably cover some game at some point, and maybe it'll be the main game of this. I don't know. Um, though that's just that's the future, and I can't comment on that. But I can guarantee that the next pals play will not be Monkey Ball One. It will be something else. Something that all of us will enjoy to the fullest. So Five Nights at Freddy's. No. It may be Five Nights at Freddy's. I don't know. It could be it could be Mario Kart Double Dash. It could be anything. So just stay tuned for that uh, as filler in between the next Let's Play and the one after that. So I'll see you guys for the ne in the next video that you watch of me. Nova is signing out as well, and I'll see you guys later. See ya. Wait, I promised at the beginning of the series that I was going to show off a glitch in Monkey Dogfight that. Nova and I discovered as children. And before this video ends, I would like to do just that. If you go into Monkey Dogfight, mm -hmm. doesn't matter which character you do, the only thing that matters is the stage. This one won't work, this one won't work. Monkey Space Wars, Space Monkey Wars. In, or the battery stage, as most people call it. Uh, it doesn't matter what settings you do, just the stage itself. The glitch is actually pretty cool. In fact, I think it could be used kind of in a competitive sense. It's almost like a capture point that gives you special advantages uh, to the person who captures it. Also, I'm going upside down. That's cool. Look at that. I'm going. That's really neat. <laughs> if you go all the way down to the bottom of the stage and down to these little trenches, Nova will explain the glitch. Okay, so what you have to do is cruise along these trenches, barely, barely touching the ground. Not sliding across it, gliding just above it, all the way to the end where you will exit out of the arena into this strange black abyss. And if you turn around, you can see the rest of the arena behind you. Now, everyone back in there can't see you. No, they can. You can see them. They can see your targeting thing. They well, just yeah. Yeah, but they can't hit you. You're completely invulnerable, except to other people who are in the abyss with you. But the cool thing about this is that I can turn around here and shoot people who are inside the globe and they can't hit me. So it's it gives a pretty cool advantage to those people who get outside this first, though the drawback is that they're extremely vulnerable when they're getting into that trench. So am I out? No, I'm, I'm still outside. 
And yeah. if you can actually go all the way up to the top. Which I'm doing right now. And I'd also like to give tr credit to Star Horse for helping us discover this because I remember when we were little kids, we were trying, we were flying down the trench like in Star Wars, <laughs> and because it was really cool looking, like it was all cinematic and stuff, and then we we're like, whoa, you can go outside. And so there are a couple disadvantages to being back here. One of them being that you can't refill missiles after you have pretty much killed everyone inside the arena. That, actually. You can't refill unless you leave the Black Abyss. Um, also, because you're getting limited number of shots off, you're not getting as many points as the people inside. So yeah. sure, you're safe, but you're not going to get as many points. So it's not really as OP as people think, as long as everyone knows how to perform the glitch. If they don't, then it's just kind of unfair, because the person who's a veteran at the game can just keep, keep on going outside of bounds. But I just think it's a really cool glitch, I wanted to show it off, because it was like the first glitch we ever discovered. And the key to shooting people inside is to slow down as much as you can, and then turn to look inside, and then turn back, so you don't accidentally fly back inside. Yeah, and I'm actually going to fly inside just to show it off. I am You can re-enter seamlessly. Yeah, uh, no. No, I can't. No, re-enter the arena. Oh, yeah, yeah. You can just go right, right back in, so you could enter at any place. But the drawback, once again, is that people can see where you're entering, so they can ambush you since you're missileless. But that's the glitch! I just thought it was really cool to show off. There are other glitches in the game. I mean, this game is actually riddled with glitches. But this is this is the cool one that can actually be used for funsies. I died. But that's it! Uh, we will see you guys later uh, for the first video of the next Let's Play. Bye! Say bye. Bye. <laughs>